He's chewing my dick. You cheated on me with this pencil dick over here. I'm sorry. You know, there's no need to be so rude to him, okay? Of course, yours is much bigger. Uh, guys! I want to apologize to both of you, okay? I just... It's just that I need something from both of you. Can you understand that? God, stop making all this noise! You bisexuals are all alike. A fucking men to that. I mean, come on, what is this, multiple choice or something? Pick one, you're either homo or hetero. We are bisexuals. Bro, well, I mean, what do you want? What is it you want? All right, enough. Who's it gonna be? Me or him? Both of you. What? Well, I could keep living with you as per usual, and I could see you three times a week. What's wrong with that? Fuck that. Double fuck that. He's right. You bisexuals are all alike. We bisexuals. Excuse me? No, dear. Some of us don't need to snap into a slim gym. Mm. Sacred, uh, what are you doing down here? <sighs> I thought I'd get some exercise, make myself a little more attractive. Why'd you put up with that cheating on you then, eh? I love her. Why do you? Yeah. Those loser guys will put up with anything. Yeah, me too. <laughs> Come on, you're Donna Summer. You're hot stuff, you could have anybody you want. No, I couldn't. Fuck, you couldn't. You want to see what I look like up until five years ago? Oh, I'm sorry. Is that your driver's license or something? Well, you carry 200 pounds pretty well. See? I swear, the way those bitches treated me. Well, that's been educational. Yeah, for me too. You know, you're not nearly the shit for brains I thought you were. Well, how could I be? Give me a hug. Come on. Come on. <laughs> All right, I'll see you later. Yeah, it's me. You sound kind of down. Ty's out of town. Just get really anxious when she's not around. So what's up? Oh, I'm just bored. I didn't know who else to call. Well, I've got the perfect tension reducer. Oh yeah, this is a great stress reducer. It's better than my vibrator. <laughs> what a rush. Yeah, there's nothing like eight hours of video game carnage to soothe the savage beast. Damn, I'm stoned. You know, you're actually pretty nice for a boy. I shouldn't get stoned. Start doing really crazy shit. 
got the munchies? No. I get horny. Um. Uh. What? Oh, you didn't hear me? I think, I think you're still dumb. I couldn't remember just what made me fall for you. Searching for others to make me feel all new. But every time I felt that feeling, I knew it wasn't what I needed. But when I got you, oh, I'm better than ever before. You made my life so special. Everything that I could want, you give it to me every part. That's why I could never let you go. No, bring it back to basics. Bring it back, back to basics. So now you're gonna. So, maybe we could uh, keep doing this on a regular basis. What? You want to live out some Mac Daddy fantasy of seeing two chicks at once? Bring it back. Yeah. I can live with that. I think I will bring you to Hotel Meurice in front of Le Louvre. You know, very nice and a nice suit. Of course, a sweet, a sweet for you. Of course. Great. Sounds like a good deal. I don't know what you're doing with me. Now, Paris, <laughs> Paris for a weekend is amazing. We've known each other a long time. All right. So what do you plan tonight? Me? Um, just, you know... Um, Nothing special? Check you out. Yeah, of course. Yeah. So there is a big event tonight at Crobar. I play uh, to the room, the small room upstairs. Oh, the VIP? Yeah, yeah. The right. VIP, of course. That's very of nice. Of course, VIP. Nice. So I uh, put you on the list and you, you come over? Around yeah. two? Between, yeah. I played from two to four, so... It'll be nice perfect. to see you. Yeah, that would be great. Sure. Yeah. Some of the vocals from uh, the 50s, the Buddy Holly, you know, just so memorable, you know. So I, it's just an interesting idea to try to, yeah. you know. It's a good new idea. I, I don't know anybody before did it, so right. there's something special with that. Yeah. 